okay guys welcome back to the channel and today we have a 2013 Honda Accord this is the six cylinder coupe as you can see um, today we're going to show you how to reset the ECU of these model Accords All right. it's a very simple procedure and most people think that you need a diagnostic machine to do this procedure but you really don't i'm going to show you an easy way of resetting the ecu um, for the purpose of maybe your vehicle has been showing up some fault codes which has been reset but still show up when the vehicle is driving and so forth or maybe you just need to reset some of the settings in the car that has been causing some issue so today i'm going to show you how to reset your ecu without a obd scanner um, so all you're going to need for this procedure is a 10 socket and a jumper cable all right so the main purpose in getting this done or the main idea behind it is that we want to disconnect the battery terminals long enough for the ECU to reset itself so in order to do that we need to pull the battery terminals and leave it off for about 30 minutes to an hour if you're not driving the vehicle an hour would be ideal for you to leave it parked so that the computer might reset itself there are certain settings in your car such as like the radio and stuff you might need to input those when you connect by the battery so let me show you this is done loosen the negative there Here. tools does not touch the casing of the car I result in a nasty shock all right so let's ensure that your tools doesn't touch the casing of the battery all right. then we're going to be using any one side of the jumper jumper cable so it might be too positive or two negative of the jumper cable. And using two negative side. So in removing the cables, you don't want them to touch the terminals of the battery also. So when you remove them, I'm just gonna use a microfiber cloth here just to prevent it from touching the battery itself use it right there as well it's on both sides and then what we want to do now is connect the cables coming from the car using both sides of the jumper cable and there Both of them, you say use the cloth so that it doesn't touch the battery itself. You just connect them. So you're gonna leave that for about an hour. So I'll check back about 12 20 or so. Half an hour to an hour. And as I said, this is my car, it's a 2013 car. I wouldn't do anything to damage it. So nothing that I'm showing in my videos or anything that would damage your vehicle. Okay, it's a safe procedure when working with these cars so that's how you reset your ecu thank you for watching the video just remember to like and subscribe and for future content just hit that bell notification see you guys in the next video